That's how we ending it? No. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Fingers is gone. Jesus Christ, Ali. That's what it's for? Cost you two fingers? I would've killed the bitch. She took my fingers? I, I, she'd have been dead. Oh, it's played out, oh, Bendito. She wasn't playing. She probably moved back to Jackson. After all that, Ellie left her life, man. I dig it. I understand, but... Understand why, Dilla. And that's it. Credits. No, another scene. Drinking coffee. coffee. <laughs> Where'd you get that? Uh, those people that came through last week. Oh. A little embarrassed as to what I had to trade to get it, but it's not bad. Had Seth under control. Yeah, I know. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. He's trying to be a dad, even though he's not a dad, you know? Uh, Dina. Is she your girlfriend? Not yet. <laughs> no. No, 
she, that was just one kiss. It doesn't mean anything. She just, I don't know why she did that. But you do like her. I have no idea what that girl's intentions are, but but I do know that she would be lucky to have you. Aww. You're such an asshole. <laughs> I'm not trying to. I was supposed to die in that hospital. Bendito. My life would have fucking mattered. But you took that from me. Oh. No, it doesn't. <laughs> if somehow the Lord gave me a second chance at that moment, I would do it all over again. <laughs> you can hate me, but you're alive, man. You're alive to hate me. I'd rather to. I'm 100 percent with him too. I'm 100 percent with him. Yeah. Sorry, just... sorry, Ellie. I would have made that decision too. I don't think I can ever forgive you for that. No, you don't have to. It's fine. Hate me. Hate me forever. But you're allowed to hate me. Yeah? But I would like to try. <laughs> oh. I like that. Jackson? Take the guitar with you. how it ended but man this game is great only reason why i'm not super happy how it ended is not how i wanted it to end i felt like the fight at the water was a cool way for them to get out their grief they should she should have let the um 
the girl go, the boy go, on the boat, bye bye, killed Abby, came back, found his house, you know what I'm saying? And then you leave the story open so the next guy, I mean, yeah, the son could be trying to hunt Ellie, maybe. But now it's just like. I feel like there was no resolution at all. Granted, she got out what she needed to get out, but I feel like it's still something like... It's still something in my heart that I need cleansing and didn't listen. Beating up her in the water and drowning her, I wanted to go all the way. And then it didn't do that. Game is amazing though. Surprisingly, a lot of the fun parts came from playing, you know, the other side, giving me that, you know, giving the players the dual sense of the story. I could care less of Abby's story, but the way they like intertwined it together, it, it made up. A, 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 you seen why you needed both. You would have never cared if you didn't play as Abby throughout that whole shit, and then Ellie you know, unhooked her and then she was gonna kill the the girl um, the boy at the end. You know what I'm saying? You would never it would have never had that like, yo, don't do that. You wildin' Ellie. But to add that whole Abby section just to get that maybe was too much. Granted, you know, I don't, I don't know how much they wanted to. Because, to, to be honest, Son's story, the little boy's story, was better than Abby's story. The little boy's story was fighting for something greater than Abby was fighting for. Abby was fighting for revenge. I felt like the little boy's story of him leaving the scars and all that, that whole shit was more meaningful with, you know, him killing his mom and sister passing too. That, to me, left a bigger impact where Abby, I didn't give a fuck. Like, her seeing her dad die, the love of her life die, her friend die, you know, that she had, like, a connection with. And then, you know what I'm saying, and then her friend was pregnant and she didn't give a fuck. Ellie killed her, the friend, and it, Abby letting her live because of the um, boy wanted her to, to live. Again, all accumulates to that end point on the beach, and we didn't get that satisfied. Uh, I don't know. That's just how I'm feeling right now as the credits are rolling. I'm probably going to do a full review, full discussion on the ending. I have to. Ending is so, but I am glad that it's kind of over. I'm glad that this weight has lifted off my chest of The Last of Us 2 because Jesus Christ, it's a good game. It's a good game. If I had to give it a score right now, I say nine out of ten because they didn't nail the landing. But it's a good game. It's a good game. Definitely, definitely a good game. Thank you, thank you, thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to. Join the family, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos, as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok, or whatever, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything 
just hit me up in the comment section below. I take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and I love it. And again, let's have that conversation down there. Here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest. I am a variety channel. I do tons of stuff, tons of Pokemon, but tons of other stuff as well. So dive into these videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.